So welcome to the new AI Smart Alerts. You can access AI Smart Alerts as you've always done at the left and go to Smart Alerts. And as you come to this page, you'll notice something looks different from the previous Smart Alerts. The difference is now it's AI powered. All you have to do is just type in a prompt of what you want to track and let the AI create the alert for you, saving you tremendous amounts of time. At the bottom below, we have a couple of preset prompts that you can just use as well if you want to just jump straight into it. And then at the bottom, you have my smart alerts, which houses all of the smart alerts you've created thus far. And then at the bottom here, you can just see what the new AI smart alerts does. So you want to get started, you track Kane Borwick tells over 100k. You do is press that or press enter, and you'll know you'll start to see the smart alerts being created from the AI side. Now, from my experience, this usually takes anywhere from 30 seconds to maybe 45 seconds. It goes much faster, but if you really wanted to, you could just close it. Also, you can also check out here prompt packs, and you get a bunch of packs, uh, those preset prompts, as I showed you earlier. Now, as you're scrolling down, you can see that the AI has already created the smart alerts and you can even configure this by editing manually. And if you like what you see, you can just create the alert. It will create the alert for you and just give it a couple of seconds and voila. Now, you just view the alert and like, there you go. The alert has been created. And as I mentioned earlier, this interface is probably familiar as this comes to editing the smart alert as you wish. Let's say if I were to click this, I can change the title. I can add wallet types as well. You can also now base it off of constant labels. Do you want to do a specific fund, a specific smart money? You can also do it by public figures as well. And then you can also even choose what chain specifically you want to track. If you scroll down, you can also look at the alert conditions is whenever they buy, whenever they sell and you can change the value of what you're. So this is 100K because I wrote down in my prompt 100K, but this is if you want to just modify the things further yourself. You can add a token. So what specific token do you want this to be tracking for when it comes to Kane Warwick on the token sector? And then you can even choose the parameters in which you want to exclude and even adjust which channel you want it to be sent to. And so you still have the luxury of being able to modify things granularly yourself, but we've now added AI to be able to create it for you so you can get started real quick instead of previously where you were just limited to the manual creation. As you see, if you notice here at the top right, you can still create things manually as you used to do before in the past. So setting up smart alerts is super easy now. If you would like to get a little recap on how to manually set up smart alerts, check out the next video and make sure to set up that smart alerts because it's a super great way to get the notifications you want easily.